And you really thought that when it's raining hard, there is no car show, but you might be wrong. Here in Old Town, Florida, you know, every Saturday there's a car show, no matter what. So I got my rain gear. You can hear, yeah, thunderstorm, lightning, we don't care. This is Florida, we get it every day, so this is what we're here for. Well, we can have a storm, tornado warning, and all of that here in Florida. But every Saturday, there is a car show here at Old Town. So, people don't care. I mean, it's June. Every afternoon, you're gonna have a thunderstorm. Big deal. So, we're here. Rain or shot. Oh yes, so we got a uh, dark swinger with a uh, 440. Obviously, the swinger didn't come with a 440. He came with, uh, I believe, a 318. It was a fast, economical kind of vehicle. Something to compete against Falcon. Falcon had like a 260, later a 289. And this is the Swinger. Or at least it says Swinger. Maybe it didn't start as a Swinger, but here we go. We got it here, it's in a car show. Oh yeah, everybody's drying up the cars. It's been raining most of the afternoon, lightning and everything, but it's time for a show. We've been having the show for about 40 years now, close to it. We have, look at this wall. We got the cruises of the month. For Friday, you don't do Friday all the months. But look at this Saturday. Boom. They made it all the way to 23. Right out of space, I guess. Yes, we have standing water, but the show must go on. I will be missing about half of the cars, but that's okay. These cars are the hardcore people. Dodge Garnet 500. It seems like the owner was a uh, infantryman and perhaps part of the 1st Cavalry Division, U.S. Army. It is not a huge boat. It's not a small car either. Convertible. And he does have the stick. You can see it through the water. The color is not the most exciting thing in the world. I'm assuming that's the original color. And they decided to stick with it. But if the owner likes it, that's all it is. That's torn it. It appears to be a 1928 Ford Model A. Apparently the, today is Puerto Rican day because most of the cars have flags. They're pretty hardcore. I mean, it's raining and we got standing water and they still come to the car show. In New York and Puerto Rico, sometimes they call themselves New Yorkans. Pretty stout. Small trunk in the back. Modern steering wheel and interior. And that over there is the fuel. It's my gravity. Not bad, huh? That over there is the shield of Puerto Rico. Estado Libre Asociado. It's a Commonwealth. That's a 28 Ford for you.
Hot emptiness, six o'clock. This should be all full. But if you want to get some price, tonight might be a good night to come out here. You hear the thunder? Yes. Hell's gonna open up on us. Well, back in the day, if you had a very simple car, you didn't have a whole lot of money. In order to make it a hot rod, you paint everything red. Yeah, red makes it more exciting and gives the illusion that it's going fast. Apparently somebody grabbed a brush and kind of went around it. Maybe a kid? I don't know. Maybe the owner. Kind of a different deck on the back. You got a wood floor. Stop it. Wait. It's work in progress. Beautiful steering wheel. I'm digging the duck dish. Yeah. It's uh, about a 51 Ford for you. Just the curves in this C3 Corvettes. Don't get old. Look at that. All those curves. This one has a Stingray with an LT1 engine. Yeah. Look at that blue tape. Back in the 60s, they had this uh, sharp cut out on the tail. They said it was for aerodynamics. I didn't know what aerodynamics was uh, back in the early 60s, but they look cool. C3 for you. Everything started with a little Jeep for the war effort. Now look where we're here. I believe it is uh, CJ5, CJ7, Renegade, probably got a 304. It's pretty well taken care of. Unfortunately, only got a bikini top, so he gets rain every time. Humongous tires. Probably do some rubbing if they go crawling. I don't think this does a whole lot of crawling. But that's the answer, CJ7. Very speedy. It's a crowd favorite. Even the stand out here where you put the foot is from the original Jeep. This thing or not? Awesome. For light driver. And this is the right way to advertise. Got a beautiful hot rod. Mildly customized. You put your logo in it. There you go. We got a rolling billboard. The Whiskey Gourmet Burgers. Yeah, that's an ad. I got three of these third generation Pontiacs. One of them got stolen. Oh, I like them. I don't know why. They're not necessarily fast. They're nice looking. Now yeah. there's a guy with guts. BMW is going to stop now. Getting handled great, but it handled okay. Very easy to work on. If you want to start working on cars, it is a good car to start. <laughs> 